So out come the two archers from both from Chinese Taipei, local archers, Fang Wan Ting and Su Yi Yun. Fang qualified in fifth position, 36 tens with a score of 571. And Su was down in tenth. He's come through nicely into when the uh, eliminations to come into the bronze medal match. Uh, had three 6-4 wins, including rather two 6-4 wins. Lost to semi-final to Liu by 6-4. Fun meantime, lost to Gabby Schlosser in the semi-7-3. But uh, interestingly, Chef, she beat two two-time Olympians on the way to this match. Fun beating... Lin Chia In and Tan Ya Ting, who we both saw in uh, the Olympic Games in Tokyo. So, very good effort from Fang to beat both of them on the way to the semi finals before she lost. So, clearly, she's That's got very good form. Indeed. Mm, it is indeed, yes. Yeah, so, she's going to go first here. Fang, the 24 year old. So just a, a slight uh, adjustment, of course. We're going to need to remind the viewers here that that uh, the 10 ring is doubled for recurve archers. Right, um, Chef? Yeah, or it's uh, half for the compound archers, depending on how you look at it. But um, it's uh, four <laughs> centimeters across rather than two centimeters across for the compound shooters. Quick release, but it was still a 10 for Sue. Fang is going to end the first set so with a nine. Set system. We're shooting set system, which means in this case that uh, Fang has already clinched the set, uh, depending on if the first arrow of Sue hits the uh, nine or if it's an eight. Um, if it hits the nine ring, then we'll have a split. So. Uh, it's uh, it's up, up to the judges now. Speaking of two-time Olympian, uh, Tanya Ting is in the coach's box for Su Yi Jun. Yeah, well, that's uh, that's really cool to see. And I can see why Fang has actually beaten the the, the two two-time Olympians, Tan and Lin. And getting through to the semi-final because two tens and a nine not a not a bad way to start a, a match so uh, let's have a look there all oh, was shared so we had an upgraded arrow that first one from sue was upgraded to a nine so it was a shared set of one apiece so here comes second set now for fang to go first yeah, that was a bit of a longer hold. Her uh, first couple of shots were a lot quicker, and now it seemed like she was planning on shooting another quick shot, and then it just didn't go through the clicker, so she needed to hold a bit longer and then lost her composure. Sue here is a uh, young archer, just 21. Very quick release, but uh, that was a 10. Yeah, I think I think the, the quick release is what she's looking for in her shot. It seems like that's where she's most comfortable. So Fang's going to lock in a score of 28, which means Sue gets a 10 here. She'll claim the second set. See, and it's oh, she's actually lost the set now. Yeah. It seems like um, what she wants to have is that she pulls back and anchors and then pretty much immediately pulls through the clicker and releases, where the uh, first and last shot of this set uh, were a bit longer. And then you can see that she gets to her anchor point, and then as soon as she gets to the anchor point, she's like hesitant because it should have clicked already. And then there is a bit of uh, hesitation, a bit of muscle tension um, that makes her shoot a bad shot. And, the eight is a great example of that. 
Well, 28 plays 27 in that set. So Fang's got the the lead now. Three set points to one. The race to six set points. A long hold for Fang there, but Sue here very quick with her releases. Uh, 28 for Sue. 10 here. Fang will take a decisive lead in the match. A little unsteady on the shooting line, though. Here. I think she does catch the line, maybe. We'll leave it yeah, up to I'm the judges, you, chef. but... Uh... <laughs> I'm with you. I reckon that's grabbed a, a piece of the line. We'll see if the judges agree, because of course if it hits the line, it defaults to the highest score. I'm liking the way Fang's shooting at the moment. She looks relaxed, even though she's a little unsteady on that last shot. Chef, she's uh, been quite composed all the way through yeah. the match. Yeah, she seems to have the right the right mindset, um, and you will always have some nerves if you're shooting in a venue like this. Um, and like we mentioned before, you want to embrace those nerves, you want to acknowledge that they're there. Um, but not be too harsh on them and not to uh, not judge too hard on yourself for having those nerves and, and experience them. So I think she's doing a great job in that. Uh, you can see that she is quite relaxed in her facial expressions and in her just communicating with her coach. Um, but you can definitely see in her shooting that there's some nervousness going on. So Fan confirmed to win that last set, 29-28. She now needs just to tie the set to claim the win and the bronze medal in the recurve competition. Well, that was a really rough shot, but uh, well, she manages to stick it in the gold, so no, nothing too wrong with it. It's going to keep the pressure on Fang because it was a good arrow from Sue. Maximum score. Wow. Well, well, well. Now Sue can claim this set here. She'll probably need to give herself the best chance of winning it. Oh, she does. Fantastic arrow from her. So she's going to win this fourth set and prolong the match. Oh, she's enjoying herself and 29 that equal to her previous best in this match in the first set and Fan dropped her status just a touch finished with just 26 in that one oh, Sue smiling enjoying herself laughing with her coach so this is uh, an interesting moment now can can Sue channel that that joy and win another set here, Chef, to take it to a, uh, to a decider. Well, I, I do uh, fancy a shoot-off every once in a while, so uh, I'm, uh, I'm hoping for a 5-5 five -five, uh, split here. Well, same equation for Fung. Just a tied set will win the bronze medal. Again, not the cleanest release I've ever seen, but uh, she still gets it into the 10 ring, which is 
A bit of a difference from 70 and 18 meters is you can get away with a bit more on this uh, shorter distance, but um, in some cases it's a game of not missing rather than hitting. Um, so it's a bit of a different dynamic to uh, the outdoor competition format. Well, Sue needs a 10 now. She tries by a point. Remember, she's got to win the set. Send it to a shoot off. Oh. Just grabbed the line, I think. It's a nine. No. Let's see if Fung here. Just needs an eight or higher. And she's got a nine. That's the nine. So it's going to be the bronze medal to Fung Wan Ting. Sue, a brave effort from her.